now before we uh, do the promotion, the Chief Clarence has a few remarks. For us that spend some time in the fire stations, we know today is a monumental day. And we know that because Father O'Hara is dressed like a priest. <laughs> This is literally the first time in my career that I have seen Father O'Hara dressed like a priest. <laughs> you look great. <laughs> Mayor Minor, members of the Common Council, Father O'Hara, other distinguished guests, and my brother and sister firefighters, welcome. Welcome to this morning's promotion ceremony. Today we are promoting 16 members of our department to new positions. Each of these promotees will assume new responsibilities and have accepted the challenge of leadership. In varying degrees, each of them will carry the responsibility of caring for and leading their brother and sister firefighters. As we ascend the ranks, we proportionally increase the responsibility of our new officers. The company officer is responsible for three other firefighters in their company. The deputy chief will be responsible for the entire city. <coughs> in its own way, is a happy burden to shoulder. Our department responded to over 21,000 emergency alarms in 2016. Each day, the visitors and residents of our city make demands on the fire department. Many different types of emergency require a workforce that is trained and ready to respond to many different types of situations. I am confident that these men are up to the challenge. Each of them has demonstrated their ability and their desire to lead. Each of them has demonstrated an ownership, a pride, and a love of our job. I am proud and honored to be the leader of such a talented group of men and women. And now, I am equally honored to present these firefighters to you as new chiefs, captains, and lieutenants of the Syracuse Fire Department. Thank you.
sometimes it's as simple, and I do this with the district sheets all the time. They're busy doing their paperwork, and they're going down the hall with a cup of coffee. It's my job to give them a cup of coffee so that they can continue to do their jobs. So sometimes it's simple, sometimes it isn't. So I want to challenge you to make sure that you give your people tools to do their job. And with that, Thank you. 